The Savannah Police Department is investigating an early morning collision involving an 18-wheeler and Ford F-150. Officers say they responded to the fiery scene at MLK and I-16 around 3.30 this morning. Police say individuals involved in that crash suffered minor injuries. The roadway is currently blocked. News 3's Christine Qualey is live on the scene this morning with the very latest. Good morning, Christine. What can you tell us? Yeah, Kim, so we are talking about a crash that just happened around 3 a.m. this morning. And as you can see behind me, we have some cleanup going on right now. There is sawdust everywhere, which came from one of the trucks. According to SPD, I talked to a captain just a few minutes ago, and there was a truck coming from I-16 and then a vehicle going southbound, and that's when the crash happened. Uh, the driver did sustain some pretty serious injuries, they told me. And if you look over to the right here, they actually just hauled away the husk of the truck that was completely torn up. So like I said, that cleanup effort is well underway. The big thing that they're focusing on right now, they said there's going to be some electrical issues and traffic light issues because of the crash and, you know, all the debris that you see here behind me. So they said, you know, the road is actually going to probably be closed for another four, maybe five hours during the day. Um, so if you are going to be coming this way on here on MLK and I-16 and you normally use this ramp, you should definitely look for an alternate route. Kim?